Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can move your Windows 11 taskbar anywhere on the screen. In this video, we're going to use Windows 11 24H2, so it is possible even on Windows 11 24H2 by using a third-party app called Start All Back. Start All Back since the beginning of Windows 11 has been, I think, the most reliable app in terms of third-party customization. And in this video, we're going to see how we can use that app in order to move our taskbar in Windows 11 24H2. So if you enjoy videos like these where we customize Windows 11, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TickPay channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. Of course, first of all, we have to get Start All Back from startallback.com, get the latest version and using the free trial version, you're going to be able to use the app for 30 days before having to get a license. But you have 30 days to see if the app works for you or not. It is really, really cheap. So if you really need those features, I think it's not really a big deal to get that. Whenever you're starting the setup, the setup is really simple. You can just select automatically download and install updates and just click on install for me. When you click on install for me, the explorer.exe will restart and the start all back configuration menu will appear. Now, when you first install start all back, you're going to notice that the start menu will be changed. If you're happy with this start menu, you can use it. But if you don't want it, you want the default start menu from Windows 11, just go to start menu and then deselect use classic enhanced start menu and you're going to have the default Windows 11 start menu. Then you have to go to taskbar and then select use enhanced classic taskbar and then click on restart now down below changing taskbar type requires restarting explorer shell. Click on restart now and you're going to notice that the taskbar will be changed a bit because it's going to use some of the start all back customization things in order to be able to move it or customize it because you can change it to small icons and so on. So you have a lot of options, but in taskbar location on screen, you can select the four possible locations, for example, left. As you can see, we have the tab bar set on left. You can select top, you can select right, and of course, you can select bottom and I think that is pretty nice. You can also select centered task icons which will give you two options separately from start button or together with the start button and as you can see this is how it looks and if we move it on the left for example you can notice that it's looking pretty good in my opinion. You can also use dynamic transparency if you want and that is also looking pretty interesting basically everything will be 100% transparent. You also have taskbar settings that will open the settings section inside Windows 11. And of course you can change the visual style of the taskbar you can select what start menu you want. As you can see, you can simply use the old Windows 7 start menu. You can select the icon size, as you can see here, or the icons margins. The default is M. So if you want to go to default, just use the M value. So things are really simple with start all back. You just need to do a few simple settings and you are good to go. And of course, you can customize start menu or explore really easily using the start all back configuration menu. And of course, if you close the configuration menu to access it, just right click on your taskbar and then click on properties and this will be opened up. Also, I'm just going to search for the Windows versions so that you can see we are using Windows 11 24H2 code 261712 basically the latest version for the release preview channel for Windows 11 24H2 of course so as I've said if you want to customize your taskbar in Windows 11 use a transparent taskbar or anything like that move it around the screen wherever you want can you start all back and see if the software does the job for you so if you enjoyed this video please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.